Burnley vs. Tottenham Odds Burnley Odds plus 480 Bet Now Tottenham Odds 182 Bet Now Draw Odds plus 330 Bet Now Over Under 2.75 Minus 120 Minus 103 Bet Now Time 4 p.m. ET Stream Peacock Odds as of Sunday at 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time and via DraftKings. Get up to a $1,000 sign-up bonus at DraftKings today or see more offers and reviews for the best online sportsbooks. Two of my favorites face off Monday afternoon, as Tottenham travel to the Turf Moor for a matchup against Burnley. Spurs have had a great start to their season, whereas Burnley have struggled a bit. The Clarets are always much tougher at home than on the road, but Burnley manager Sean Dyche will be happy to take a point from this fixture. Meanwhile, Jose Mourinho will want all three for Tottenham. This should be a fun one to dive into. Burnley Burnley have had a tough start to the season, losing three and drawing one to put them 18th in the table entering Monday's match. The competition hasn't been overly difficult either, and the Clarets' results have left me a bit concerned for their prospects this season. For starters, the club refuses to spend in the transfer window, which has left Deitch wondering about his future at the club. On top of that, the squad isn't fully fit, which makes his job even more difficult. Expected goals also known as XG, is an advanced statistic that gives an indication of whether results are based on sustainable factors like a steady creation of scoring chances, or whether it is down to aspects such as luck or outstanding goalkeeping. What Burnley has going for them is that they are still playing supreme defensively and have an elite goalkeeper in Nick Pope, as well as one of the Premier League's better managers running the ship. The challenges for the Clarets are that they're struggling to create scoring chances, the squad lacks depth and their usual home field advantage is muted without supporters. Burnley are much better offensively when Dwight McNeil is dangerous on set pieces and whipping in successful crosses. Last season, he led the team in expected assists XA, with 7.56. So far, he has 0.41 XA, which would put him at 3.90 at the end of the season. I wouldn't extrapolate that, but I'm just quantifying why the Clarets might be struggling offensively. Burnley are trailing their XG game from last season by 0.45, and McNeil creating more chances would be a big boost toward improving those figures. Defensively, the Clarets are conceding 1.10 XG game, which is an improvement from last season's 1.42. Tottenham Spurs have had a very strong start to the season. 8 points from their first 5 games doesn't do justice to Mourinho's men's performances. Spurs 2 draws against Newcastle and West Ham should have been easy wins, but they conceded late equalizers in cruel fashion. You could say that it is on Tottenham to see out those results. I would agree somewhat, but I think they get the full 3 points 9 times out of 10 in those situations.